Watch you guys got another video here for you. In this one we're going to be taking a look at how to download Firefox via FTP in your command prompt window. Now this will work in Windows XP, Vista, Windows 7 and Windows 8, 32 bit and 64 bit versions. So what we want to do is go down to the start of the all button here and type CMD. This will open up a command prompt window and you can also open up a PowerShell window if you want it's the same thing. Then we're going to type FTP here to change it to our FTP window and then from there we're going to go open now we need to open up uh, an actual site so we're going to go to releases.mozilla.org that will connect to that server now from there we need to put in a username and this is going to be anonymous so we're going to go anonymous now password we don't need to worry because we don't need one so we're going to push enter here and login is successful so we're now logged on now we need to change the actual location so we can download the file so we're going to go change directory cd space pub for public forward slash mozilla dot org forward slash firefox forward slash releases forward slash latest forward slash and then we want win32 for for a 32 bit version and also forward slash we need to go to en dash gb for great britain now if you want to do your own country i america or something like that you'd use us push enter and now we've changed our directory to that location. We're going to type ls here. This is going to show us what files are on there. And we can see this Firefox setup 15.0.1.exe. That's the file we need to download. So the first thing we need to do next is type binary. So we're going to type binary. That's switching it to binary mode. We also need to typing quote PASV and this is going to change it to passive mode just in case we have any issues of downloading now a lot of people say you can't use passive mode in FTP well we just changed it here so all we need to do now is change our directory to the desktop where we want to download our file now you may have a bit of trouble putting in your C root directory so I'd advise you to put it on your desktop so we're going to go LCD desktop this will put it onto our desktop next thing we need to do is type get space and then that little speech mark and then we need to do Firefox space setup and then another space and then we need to do the actual version in this case it's 15.0.1 and then .exe and then end it with that little speech mark push enter and there you can see it's opening up a connection and it's now downloading that to our desktop and that's now received the file and that means now we'll be able to install it and there we have our file just there so we could now install that now that'll be useful if you haven't got a browser on the system or the browser's corrupt and uh, you want to be able to download a, a new browser to install uh, it's, or you can do it other ways but this is just another way of doing it as well okay so I hope that's useful you can use this method for other things as well maybe download other browsers if you've got other FTP sites that you want to use it for and it's just a nice little neat trick to use okay so I hope you enjoyed it my name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk if you enjoy these videos please remember guys hit that subscribe button also rate and favorite me videos if you enjoy them if you've got any video requests that you want me to do then send me a message on YouTube if you've got any issues with your computers or anything like that and you want some help then the best place to post that is on the forum it's no good sending it to me on uh, on Facebook or on YouTube because it will just get missed okay so thanks again for watching guys thanks for your support bye for now